Well, good morning, everyone, and welcome to Monday's Thought for the Day. Psalm 119 is the longest of the 150 psalms. It's split into 22 equal stanzas with eight verses each. And within a stanza, the first word of each verse begins with the same Hebrew letter. And each stanza then follows through all the 22 letters of the Hebrew alphabet. For us, the equivalent would be a long poem with the first word of the first eight verses, all beginning with the letter A. And then the first word of the next eight verses would all begin with the letter B and all the way through to Z. Now, the psalm is a wonderful celebration of the goodness of God's word. God's law, that is his loving instruction to his people. And perhaps because of its length, it's easy to put the psalm to one side. Well, for the next two weeks, I'm simply going to read out two stanzas a day, perhaps with a brief reflection and a short prayer. And I hope that just the act of listening to it being read may encourage each of us to follow the psalmist in delighting God's word even more. So today, I'm going to read verses 1 to 16. Blessed are those whose ways are blameless, who walk according to the law of the Lord. Blessed are those who keep his statutes and seek him with all their heart. They do no wrong, but follow his ways. You have laid down precepts that are to be fully obeyed. Oh, that my ways were steadfast in obeying your decrees. Then I would not be put to shame when I consider all your commands. I would praise you with an upright heart as I learn your righteous laws. I will obey your decrees. Do not utterly forsake me. How can a young person stay on the path of purity by living according to your word? I seek you with all my heart. Do not let me stray from your commands. I've hidden your word in my heart that I might not sin against you. Praise be to you, Lord. Teach me your decrees. With my lips, I recount all the laws that come from your mouth. I rejoice in following your statutes as one rejoices in great riches. I meditate on your precepts and consider your ways. I delight in your decrees. I will not neglect your word. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we thank you for this majestic psalm. May we delight to live according to your word too. In Jesus' name. Amen. Have a good Monday. See you tomorrow.